Hello, great to have you with us. Our travels have taken us to the south of France. We're at the Orange Vélodrome. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's France against Denmark. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Raphael Varane plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. Paul Pogba plays with N'Golo Conte. Oh, Derek, great opportunity here. Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. That's useful play. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Karim Benzema, who's played at such a high level in an attacking sense for so long. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him here? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Benzema. Moussa Diaby. And it looked as though they might be in just for a second or two. Kasper Dolberg. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Daniel Vass. And Hoybier with it. Christensen. Dolberg has it. And an astute piece of defending. Karim Benzema. Coman. Coman's pass needed to be better. And plenty of room in the wide area. Kasper Dolberg. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Pogba. Into the advanced position. Benzema. Over the touchline for what will be a France throw. Pogba. Diaby Hernandez might go ahead well last gasp defending but brilliant defending and so there it is the 